Alright, got my key. It's time. Oh, shit. This is what we want right here. Let's try this one. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I was scared it wasn't going to come in time today because with my packages it usually like comes like a little bit later than it says or it was supposed to come like anywhere from 3 to 5 and around it was 5.30 so I got it like pretty much um, in time so I'm just going to open it up right now yeah, honestly I don't know what they sent me because I know they're dropping soon and they're going to send like the athletes like the drop right but I don't know if they sent it in here which I got it because it's a very small bag but yeah this package is just for basically joining the team Ooh. Alright, we're not need no knife, okay? Alright, let's see what we get. Yeah. Ooh, okay, okay. My bad, I should have like opened it and not threw it on the bed. I don't know why I opened it like in my back room. So first, it's Oblivion sweater. This is actually hard. Here, let me put in the lighting. I'll probably try it on too. Look at these bags, bro. These are actually like legit bags. And then I'm pretty sure this is a Reaper tee. I'm opening up right now. So on the front has the Oblivion print. And then back. So this is the first shirt. It feels a little bit bigger. Pretty sure it's the same size though. And this is just the same tee with the Oblivion print, but just in white, and then the Reaper on the back. And I got all these in medium. I'm gonna put all these on and then show you guys what it looks like. I'm 5'6", 130, I think seven for reference. And then also, it comes with these cool little stickers. I'm probably gonna put these on my phone and replace them for the old Young LA stickers. So here's the first shirt. It's pretty nice. It doesn't really like hug your arms, kind of like how the Young LA type of clothes wear but I look I don't okay I don't want to say it looks goofy but I mean sometimes it looks better to have like more of a casual you know fit instead of like the ones that hug your arms a lot so back front feel me let me know how y'all feel about these and then this is the white one right here I like this one a lot I think I'm gonna wear the black one today though for the gym okay this one's already feels hella comfy and then the oblivion the oblivion sign the same one on the stickers I think this is a medium too. Um, yeah, all these fit perfectly. If y'all are around, you know, like my size, then I recommend you guys getting a medium because it doesn't fit like too tight or too baggy. But wearing the black today, I'm very hyped. You guys, code Dame for Oblivion. This brand's gonna be the next big thing. I promise you guys that. Go follow them on Instagram. I know they have um, Instagram, TikTok. They have their website up, but I think that's really it. And I'm gonna get another package when the drop happens. I'm not too sure like when that is, I have to double check. But I'll make another video on that and then yeah, if I can I'm gonna try to make the next video of us going to Planet Fitness and trying to get a lift in. Y'all look what we got. I went to Vitamin Shop yesterday and I wasn't really planning to get this one in particular, but I saw it was like the last one there and I love Kool-Aid so I went with this one. But yeah, anyways, today's the next day and I'm gonna be filming the pull day as promised because I'm not trying to film another push day. But yesterday though I hit 185 on bench, which is like it's not that crazy because I could I could have hit it like a long time ago. So when I was like a little bit smaller and like lighter, um, I was really focused on my strength. So I would always bench and be consistent with it. Yeah. And then I noticed my chest is like a little bit imbalanced. So I was like, all right, I'm just gonna do dumbbell benching. So I got really strong at that, and I'm still strong at both of them, kind of. I feel like if I kept benching, I could have been on like a 205 or something. It's not like crazy good for me, but you know, it's, you know, cool little number. And I'm pretty light right now. Yeah, I said I'm 134, so, you know, I'll take it. But I'm starting to get in benching more, so expect that number to be increasing. Yeah, but anyways, I'm hitting pull today. I'm going to sport, and the last time I was there, they, um, uh, and the last time I was there, they told me to stop filming, like, my video, my camera. But I think since I'm going by myself today, then they really won't care, because they'll just be me, and not, like, all my homies and all that. So hopefully I can, you know, be sneaky with it and film a whole video, because I really want to go to sport. I like the lighting a lot better than LA Fitness. LA Fitness kind of is bland. But yeah, I'm gonna make this concoction up. Oh yeah, let me show you guys a fit though. Yeah, yesterday I wore the black t-shirt, but today's white tee. I have a red beater under it. Here's the back. Code name, y'all. Code name. Oh yeah, by the way, I'm gonna be wearing these shoes right there. All right, I'm gonna bring y'all to my other desk because it's kind of more fun on this desk, even though I gotta clean it now. Way too messy. I'm not gonna even clean. It. I'm just gonna place it on top of things that are already on the desk. There we go. That works. All right, scooter everything right there. Here we go. Got the pre right here. I need to get my little cup. Here's my little concoction. The ice cube's already melted, which is kind of sad. This is just water and creatine. I didn't put Gatorade Zero in it this time. Like I usually do with my pre's, just because I want like the real flavor, you know, of the Kool Aid. And but next time I'll probably do Gatorade Zero because it just tastes better like all the time. Punch this. Damn boy. Yeah. 
you guys don't punch it, like, what are you doing? There you go. Alright, I'm gonna give it a smell. Usually, like, when I first get pre's, they don't smell like anything. Okay, and it kind of does smell like Kool-Aid, though. It smells like juice. Bro, the thing I love about Rise is they make their scooper small. Like, the other companies, they'll make their scooper, like, ten times bigger than the container, and then it won't even fit. Like, I feel, like, I feel dumb explaining that, but if, I'm pretty sure you guys have the same problem. Like, you know when the scooper's, like, way too long, it's like, bend it a certain way and get back in the container? Hopefully, it's not just me. But. So, I'm gonna go, like, one scoop so we get the actual flavor, you feel me? Damn, boy. It smells really sweet. All right, bro, I'm looking, look at the color, but that's OP. Oh, yeah. All right, I'm gonna give y'all a taste this right now. That's good. That's good. But the flavors on me, no one does it better than rice. All right, yeah, this is hard. Yeah, okay. I like this better than Ring Pop. I'm not gonna lie. The Ring Pop is really good, but it's just like a little bit too sour for my liking. I like my pre's kind of just sweet. This, I say a nine out of 10. It tastes like tastes like Kool-Aid. It has a little bit, you know, like the pre-workout flavor. It's not as much as the Ring Pop, I think, just cause it's not um, sour. It just it tastes subtle and like chill. You know, it's like a little bit like that, like, that taste that it's like ugh. But it's only a little bit, and I feel like I could just sip on this. This gas, bro. Like if you drink Gorilla and you could actually drink that shit, like you're a fucking animal. All right, rise, please put me on. All right, y'all. I was finishing up my pre and stuff, and then I realized it's 4:13 and or it's 4:14 now. But LA Fitnesses and Esportas, I'm pretty sure on, on weekends they close at like five or four. So. <sighs> Looks like I'm not working out here. I'm probably gonna call my mom, see if I can go back home and just hit the home gym. But yeah, it's a bummer, but it's whatever. exercise to do and then I'm done with this workout it honestly went by kind of quick like compared to it usually does because I feel like when I'm in here for so long it like makes it feel like it's even longer because I'm just in this one little space but yeah the pre is starting to wear off and it's like been like three to four hours since I initially took it so energy good pumps are pretty solid I've had a pretty good pump it's like kind of like you know like just like a regular pump though so I don't think the pumps too crazy nothing special about that um, focus I'm pretty focused feel good Good pre. I already know what to expect. It's not the same thing, but the flavor is gas. So finish up this workout and yes. Do you like these little sonnets? Cause I wrote them just for you. How quickly they turn sour. So be careful who you screw. Yeah,